G'day. In answer to one question submitted by Paul, I would like to just <coughs> show it, reiterate again. These prices are in the macro. You can put your own prices in over here too and run your own demos. But let, let's look at what's happening here. The difference between 631 and 628 is 3 pips on the Australian dollar. When these two are equal, then the price is buy now. If we go to the meta uh, to the meta market for and look at the Australian dollar, the price is one oh five one two, and it's one oh five five oh five three pips. So what is that telling you? It's telling you that when this gets within the, the uh, price of three pips and the market is down, it's telling you you can buy here and <coughs> you can either go either way up or down, but at least you're buying in the center of a potential move. And the chances are that if you're looking at your chart in correct proportion and looking in here which we'll do now you can see your support and resistance is 10531 so you, you've got uh, that pips down using the spreadsheet only it gives you an advantage to look at the overall market in as fact of uh, the whole spread and so that when on the 14 these two figures become equal this figure here and this figure here and that is like the zero point of the hedge of the 14 currencies and depending on your um, chart in the uh, and we'll look at it in the hedge basket sorry it gives you the indication how many uh, pips away from the bottom it is and that's just if it hits the bottom the chances are it's going to go up so you go long on your hedge so that's basically the simple way of explaining it to you once again on the chart you can look at your particular currency how many pips away it is and you can take that as a zero point of entering into the hedge and into the trade i hope that helps bye for now from brian